low class and poor. The word that comes to mind when thinking about trailer parks or mobile homes is lower socioeconomic class. I think of people who have low incomes and therefore can really only afford a trailer, uh, a mobile home or a trailer to live in. Or people who don't have jobs or don't have really good jobs. People of lower socioeconomic status or those who work blue collar jobs may tend to live in mobile homes or trailer parks. We don't exactly know what kind of people I think live in there. I guess low income families or people in general. As But the first thing I think of is Hollywood's portrayal of people who live in trailer parks as they usually have a negative view of them. Yes, I do think there's a stigma against people who live in trailer parks. I think a big reason why people have this idea or this bias against trailer parks and why they think they look ugly is because movies and TV shows usually depict them like that. So maybe if there's a better effort to make them seem better looking or just nicer looking in movies and TV shows and in general like that, maybe it would be a better effort to change people's opinion. I do believe there's stigma against mobile homes due to the fact that they're associated with lower socioeconomic class. And so the solution to that is addressing the larger problem at hand, which is our unemployment rates, and providing more jobs and resources for those people that live there. I believe people who live in trailer parks are, stigma are highly stigmatized due to Hollywood's portrayal of them. And it's probably going to be hard to change people's ideas uh, based on the stereotypes because because it's the negative stereotypes are so ingrained in people's minds but I believe a, I guess a documentary or just uh, a sway in Hollywood's portrayal of them could potentially change people's minds. 